Yeah, yeah, he's actually coming in this morning. Yeah, I know, it's a bit like dead man walking. <laughs> he's here. Philip, welcome. Uh, good to see you, please uh, take a seat. Um, now look, this will just take a couple of minutes, so uh, if you can go that long without raising interest rates, that'd be fantastic. Um, now obviously your term as Reserve Bank Governor is coming to an end, and before the government decides whether or not to uh, extend that term, we did just want to conduct a little performance review. So firstly, the good news. You, Philip, are the first Reserve Bank Governor to be the subject of a nationwide poll. That's pretty good. Uh, the bad news is, uh, more than half of Aussies say Philip Lowe should lose his job. Yeah, I know that doesn't feel great, mate. Um, I know it feels unfair that you know the whole nation is voting on whether or not you should stay or go, like it's some sort of monetary policy-based masked singer. But um, on the plus side, with numbers that low, you could be opposition leader. So, you know, think about it. Um, now, obviously, the Prime Minister has not made his decision yet. Don't panic. But I must warn you, he has been asked about you. Is he gone then, Philip Lowe? <laughs> Well, I have to be honest with you, I don't love this for you. Uh, I think it's probably something to do with the PM laughing uh, and the crowd laughing. Uh, I think it's all the laughing that's concerning me. But what can we do? Well, have you considered changing your name? Because unfortunately, your current name really does lend itself to puns. How low can you go in the low life? Victims of low blow. Home truth a low blow. Low blow a mistake. Low blow. Low blow. Low blow. Low blow. Low blow. Sorry, that last one was about Kenny Lowe, but you know what happened there, don't you? Popular Perth Glory coach Kenny Lowe has been dumped. Huh? So, where did it all go wrong? Well, I don't want to put it all on the fact that you said that interest rates would stay low until at least 2024, but if I had to pick one thing, I guess I'd put it on the fact that you said that interest rates would stay low until at least 2024. We've had 12 interest rate rises since then, Phil. 12. Do you get a free coffee after every 10? What's going on here, mate? Phil, I know that this feels rough, and obviously you're just one man with your little up and down interest rate knob, and there's a whole board that helped make this decision, and no one's making puns about their names, but get up, Phil. Whatever the government decides, I want you to know that you are not a scapegoat, okay? You're really more of a sacrificial lamb. Okay, thanks so much, Phil. We'll catch you at the next rate rise. Bye.